Thank you for joining us. I'm Erin Davison. And I'm Tom Zaleski. We'll bring you that story in just a few minutes. First, though, more than 33,000 people say, I do, in Wisconsin every year, which can generate about $800 million in business for the state. But several prominent wedding venues have closed within the past year. One local wedding expert hopes to generate business while reversing this trend. And Local 5's Rhonda Fox brings you her story. A common idiom heard at weddings is out with the old and in with the new, which may be why the Meadow, Monarch Gardens, and Darboy Club have all closed within the past year. So what other facilities don't have, particularly banquet facilities or convention centers, is they don't have windows, they don't have light, and they're dark rooms. And so this has all of that. More people are passing on banquet halls and choosing non-traditional spaces for events, which rose to 15% in 2017. I think that this venue is a little bit different than others as you have. We're able to have the capacity up to 400, which a lot of people are looking for. And then also that you have a choice in catering. I think a couple would choose this venue because it's all ready. It's done for you. It's easy. Allison hopes her 10 years in the wedding industry is the icing on the cake to kindle local business. So having all that support from the community and from our current clients is really, it's amazing and it'll be fun and we've been having a lot of success so far and we only hope to have more. Reporting in De Pere, Rhonda Fox, Local 5 News. And for more information on the Ledgecrest Reserve, you can visit our website at wearegreenbay.com.